Thank you, uh, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, the spending bill we will vote on later today will pass because there is something in it for almost everyone. But there is nothing fiscally conservative about it. It busts all the budget caps, adding $300 billion over the next two years when spending was already going up anyway. There are no pay-fors or offsets for the disaster billions as we have done in the past. I repeat, there is nothing fiscally conservative about this bill. Our deficit for the last fiscal year was an astounding $666 billion. This bill makes it certain that this fiscal year it will be even higher. This bill raises our national debt limit when our debt is already a mind-boggling, incomprehensible $20 trillion. This bill puts us on a path to a $30 trillion debt in a very few years. I say again, there is nothing fiscally conservative about this bill. The easiest thing in the world to do, Mr. Speaker, is spend other people's money. But this is getting ridiculous. There is an old saying about spending like a drunken sailor. Even drunk sailors never spent money this recklessly. And I will say once again and close by saying there is nothing conservative or nothing fiscally conservative about this bill. I yield back.